Hello friends. Today we are going to discuss a very famous coding interview question, which is the celebrity problem. So if you are someone who is looking to crack the coding interview at a big product based company, then this video is for you. Okay, so let's start. In the question, we are given that n people are in a room. Okay, so we have to find the celebrity and we can check that the definition of celebrity says a celebrity does not know anyone including himself this we are considering for making the problem statement easier but everyone else knows him for example let's say the celebrity is tom cruise and like he doesn't know anyone else but all of them know oh yeah all of us knows him so we have to find the celebrity in the room so let's say we are given four people in the room a b c and d and you are given a graph to show that who knows whom so if this index is one it means that a knows c okay so it's row wise and then column wise so in this you have to check the row and then the column so this person in this row knows the person in this column so if this one is one it means that d knows c okay so this is what we are given this is the input now we can move on to how to solve okay so this is a question in which you can think that since we are given a 2d matrix so it is a n square problem or maybe a non linear time problem but if you think a bit then you will see that we have a good solution a optimal solution which can be solved in linear time for this question so how do we solve it in n time or in linear time which is actually what the interviewer wants let's think a bit more and consider the definition very well so it says that a celebrity doesn't know anyone but everyone else knows him so let's take an example for example here we are seeing that a knows c right so a knows c we can see in this given input that a knows c so at first we have to ask this question that a knows c or not so there can be two answer either a knows c or a doesn't know c okay so if the answer is yes then what will happen if a knows c then can a be a celebrity think that if a knows celebrity uh, if a knows c then from the definition we can say that see that a uh, celebrity doesn't know anyone okay but here a knows c so a is not a celebrity okay but if a does not know c okay so if a doesn't know c then c cannot be a celebrity because everyone knows a celebrity it said in the definition so we will say that c is not a celebrity okay so we can see that if the answer is yes or if the answer is no then from each of the case we can either discard a from here or we can discard c from here okay so we'll take up elements or persons pairwise and we'll check that whom we can discard so let's say we choose like this a b c and d then we take pair a and b okay let's run this example and only so we can check that this is zero which means that a does not know b so we can write it knows okay does a know b a doesn't know b okay so what do we do since a doesn't know b we will follow this rule that 
will discard the second one will discard b okay and we'll keep a with us because a is a potential celebrity okay now b is removed so we have a c and d okay so we'll do the question again so does a know c and what do you see that a knows c or not yes a knows c okay yes a knows c so if the answer is yes we'll follow this rule okay so we'll discard a okay so in this step we are left with which options c and d okay so we'll check whether c knows d and then we can see that c doesn't know d okay so the answer is no so we say that it's okay discard d because when the answer is no you discard the second one okay so we have discarded c so we have to check at last that c is celebrity or not because c is the last remaining person okay so when there is only one person we have to check whether he is the celebrity or not so we can check it by we can by traversing the row of that element okay so we have to just check whether he knows anyone else or not because by now we are sure that no one knows him we just have to check he knows anyone or not but then we can see from the row that all elements are zero which means that c doesn't know a c doesn't know b c doesn't know c by the definition of the problem because we are saying that it's including himself and also we can see that c doesn't know d okay so we can say since this condition matches that row wise all elements are zero then we can say that c is a celebrity right i think this problem is clear to you it's a very simple problem an interesting problem but very common question asked in interviews of big product based companies like amazon google facebook microsoft etc so and this also is the most optimal solution you might not be able to think of it in the first attempt but yeah it's pretty easy so thank you and if you like the video please subscribe to my channel and like and share the video and also provide your valuable comments so that i get a feedback of what how were you liking it thank you